Hey everybody, Ryan here from Android Calls. I'm going to play Hidden Through Time to Miss and Magic. So I've been doing this for a little bit. It's just a standard little tap and play, find the hidden things in the game. So I'm just going to, I'm using this on the one pad, one plus pad. So it's a very interesting, you know, style. Um, it's not as intuitive as you may think, but they're really trying to get you to play something a little different. So here's an example. As it loads up. Sinbad's many travels. I tried to tell you the stories. And you're supposed to go through and you have all these things to find. Now I found everything except I believe I have not found that one secret hidden extra this thing secret objective, so I don't know. You can zoom in and out. Now you're supposed to tap around now. Some things you can tap and they jiggle and they move and you can find out what's in them. And it's not super intuitive which things will actually move. Like, did you know that if you tap there, you can get underneath so you can see behind it. And then you can tap sail down the furrow there. So then I found uh, the secret one here. Let's go to the next level just to show you an example of what goes on. Sinbad's travels have now brought him oh, to the beautiful... Like... Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, it looked very similar to one I had done already. Okay, so now the interesting thing about it is that you're noticing as each of these things have a different thing on top. And this relates up to up here. The, the fact that you can change between daytime or nighttime or day and rain or whatever it may be. And that changes when you can find those different things. Is that a snake I can find? So... It's just a slightly different little scene. Now they give you a little bit of a cheat to tell you, if I tap on something, it tells you where does this money come from. So you're gonna look through these to see if you can find something with money to see if that might be able to help you out. So normally I like to see, okay, well, which one should I do first? Let's do this something in the sun. Okay, where do I put this official document? Now, again, it doesn't look like much, but it, we're gonna tap on each of these and we can see inside now oh, that was a mouse apparently you're looking for something that's just slightly out of what the way like sometimes that can get moved so it's not that people I'm really looking for uh, this thing documents Sunny? Super exciting with this, but it's just one of those. Hey, you want to kill a few minutes? Tap around, see what you see. There's no ads, so you don't have to worry about every 10 seconds. And some of the games we play, they're like this, where there's you get met with an ad, and you have to swipe that away. Mom. So this looks like a bunch of documents. So maybe it's around here somewhere. Looks like someone who's worried about documents. Mom. It's gonna look exactly like that, right there. Okay, so what else is in this sign? This sea salt. In this region, sea salt is a treasure. So that might mean, it is it either in the cooking area? What does it look like? Oh, I'm turn the torches on. Either somewhere near the sea. Do we have the sea? Oh, look at there's some stuff over here. Alright. Okay. There's no sea. Anywhere near yeah, this is the desert, of course, there's no sea. Maybe in our treasure vault. Let's go up to this level. 
we see any sea salt. Just kind of tapping around and looking for what you may think. Not, not timed or anything, as far as I can tell, for you to try to find these different features. But you're just kind of going around. So that's it in a nutshell. Like I said, it's not super intuitive to know, oh, well, if I tap the dog, the dog will run off or something like that. You never know. Sometimes you just gotta tap around a few things and see if you can find it. So there's a balanced diet. I don't know what that is. So something with soldiers. Okay, well that's it for me guys. Talk soon.